case you didn't know, these are two football clubs that do not get on. It should be feisty both on the pitch and loud from the stands, as it is so often here at Ellen Road. Plenty to play for for these two teams for very differing reasons. Leeds looking for an instant return to the Premier League in place at the top of the Championship. For Millwall, it is all about staying in the division. Go again here, and here's Nonto. Looking to just wriggle between the gaps. Nonto strike! Fantastic goal! It is a blockbuster from Willy Nonto. Well, they've been the better side. They've been the more threatening. And now leads ahead in wonderful fashion. And he had plenty to do here, Willie Nonto, but just look at the power on that strike. It ripped past Sarkic in the Millwall goal. Nothing he could do to keep that out. It was a sizzling strike to electrify Ellen Road. And he wasn't too popular at the start of the season, Willie Nonto. But he is playing a big part now in Leeds' push to return to the Premier League. I think he might have enjoyed that as well. But, uh, just drifts out to that left-hand side once again. Okay. Waiting again in the middle, Ruta. Just trying there to get the better of Norton Cuppy. He'll have to settle for a corner. Buoyant player, Jorginho Ruter, he loves a bit of trickery. Coffee did well. Let's work this one short. Somerville. Still Somerville looking to engineer, half a yard and he gets the strike away. And it draws the save from Mateo Sarkic. And he sensed that that was what Somerville was looking to do all along. Just shift it onto his right foot. Corners racking up for Leeds in this first half. They have scored just seven goals from the corners so far this season. And it comes to the front post. And Cooper's challenge. And Moved away by Stephen Martin, who took a long, long look there. Now Honeyman, he can bring it under control, and he hooks it on, trying to find Obafemi. Now Fleming for Millwall, rare opportunity for them to come forward. And you can hear what Leeds United fans think about the fact that they weren't just awarded a penalty. Roden, oh, he's caught by Cooper, isn't it? Roden's holding his face. The knee of Cooper and then up the chest area catching the Leeds defender. It was an awkward and clumsy challenge and look at the referee. He had an unimpeded view, he could not have seen that any better. And there's also the potential for a handball in there against Cooper as well. So Millwall have got extremely lucky there. James preparing to come on and we're hearing that it will be the Leeds goal scorer Willy Nonto who will depart and you think that perfection will be put his way as he leaves the field of play. A wonderful goal, one of the best goals we've seen at Ellen Road this season from him. Here's Somerville getting plenty of touches of the ball. Leeds have favoured working it down the left this afternoon. Burpo's ball and Ruter denied once, it comes back off the post. Leeds just cannot force this second goal. Millwall hanging in this game. 
as we see again how close Leeds United were just a few moments ago. So doubling their lead here this afternoon. Ruta denied the first time and then Sarkic when it came off his leg, crashed back off the post. And works it left here and Joe Bryan advancing. Bryan strike takes the deflection. Swung in now, it's a dangerous delivery, unconvincing by Melia. And a chance to strike from the edge of the box. Now Cooper's effort. And it runs just wide, but this is the risk that Leeds are taking by not putting this game to bed. Second strike, I think it hit Roden and Cooper. And he had much to do as he turned and fired it towards goal. Remain a real edge to this game. Of top level experience, Jaffit Tanganga. He played 50 times, or well, has played 50 times already for his parent club Tottenham, but he's turned there by Rute. Rute's ball across goal. Dan James now can wrap it up for Leeds, and he does exactly that. Off the bench, and he may well have just sealed the three points here this afternoon. His 12th goal of the season. Millwall have battled valiantly. But there may well be no way back in this game now. And Leeds United on course to move to the top of the championship. Good work by Ruta, who used his body well. And he managed to thread it through the tightest of gaps to find Dan James. He displayed real patience there. Just delaying on his strike. Of deflections on its way through, but Millwall couldn't keep it out. Just held back initially, didn't he, Dan James? And skipped up off Joe Bryan. And Daniel Farker now, well, perhaps he can start to celebrate. You can see what that goal means to him. His side are heading to the summit of the championship. second goal he's paid a heck of a lot of money to bring him to the club 35 million was the reported fee from Hoffenheim 14 months ago 12 touches inside the middle box and this afternoon Dan James is looking for his second of the day and he wasn't too far away that would have been some way to bookend this day for Leeds United but it came back off the post Plenty to deal with today. Stephen Martin, the referee. It's been a keenly fought contest and continue to step his time in the game as well. He issues a yellow card to Ilya Gruev. So we see this effort from Dan James again open things up and we just try to sneak it. Successive games against Rotherham and Huddersfield coming up at the beginning of April. A bit of work to do to get over the line. And the Falcons side are going to lead the championship this evening. Job done for Leeds United, who are top of the championship. 2 0 win here over Millwall this afternoon. Their remarkable 2024 goes on. 13 games played, 12 wins and a draw. 20. Eight goals scored in that time and just three conceded. Willie Nonto with a fabulous hit to put Leeds ahead in the first half. And then Dan James off the bench to wrap up the victory as he made it to 37 points from a possible 39 since the turn of the year for Leeds. A frustrating day for Millwall, but they can take plenty from it. Leeds United run out winners here this afternoon and are at the summit of the championship. It finishes Leeds United 2, 0-0.